Hi. A year ago last December, I made probably one of the best decisions of my entire life. We took off and went up to see John Prine at the uh, Sony Center in downtown Toronto. Wonderful concert, of course. We have become uh, absolutely enamored with his new CD, Tree of Forgiveness, and in particular, a few of the songs on that CD. Uh, one of which is the one I'm going to try to do for you here. Uh, as he was introducing this song, he kind of went through his thought process on what was behind the writing of it. He said he was uh, reading the paper one day and he saw where Pluto wasn't a planet anymore, that it had been downgraded from being a planet. It wasn't allowed to be a planet. And John says, well, somebody ought to be speaking up for Pluto. He also knew about this uh, statue in Birmingham, Alabama, a statue of Vulcan that was absolutely beautiful and glorious in its youth and was let to go kind of run down in its later years. And at one point they were even using it to sell pickles out in front of a pickle factory. And he saw that those two stories, he thought, kind of went together and kind of shared a, a common spirit. Uh, then for the last verse, uh, John said what he did was uh, sing about a bunch of stuff he was thinking about. So here we have the Lonesome Friends of Science. Some friends of science say the world will end most any day. Well, if it does, then that's okay. Cause I don't live here anyway. I live down deep inside my head where long ago I made my bed. I get my mail in Tennessee. My wife, my dog, my kids, and me. Poor old planet Pluto now. Never stood a chance, no how, when he got uninvited to the interplanetary dance. Once a mighty planet there, not just an ordinary star, hanging out in Hollywood, in some old funky sushi bar. The lonesome friends of science say, the world will end most any day. Well, if it does, then that's okay, cause I don't live here anyway. I live down deep inside my head where long ago I made my bed. I get my mail in Tennessee, my wife, my dog, my kids and me. The Vulcan lives in Birmingham, sometimes he just don't give a damn. His head is full of bumblebees. His pride hang down below his knees. Venus left him long ago for a guy named Mars from Idaho. The Vulcan sent a wedding gift, three-legged stool and a wheelchair lift. The lonesome friends of science say, this world will end most any day. Well, if it does, then that's okay, cause I don't live here anyway. I live down deep inside my head, where long ago I made my bed. I get my mail in Tennessee, my wife, my dogs, my kids, and me, uh-huh. Those bastards in their white lab coats who experiment with mountain goats should leave the universe alone. It's not their business, not their home. I go to sleep and it never rains. My dog predicts hurricanes. She can smell a storm a mile away. That's all the news we have today, uh-huh. The lonesome friends of science say The world will end most any day Well, if it does, then that's okay Cause I don't live here anyway I live down deep inside my head Where long ago I made my bed I like to find mail in Tennessee My wife, my dog, my kids and me, uh-huh Thank you.